so I have to head to the oil derrick, but first I need a boombox and let's explore out in the outback. I know it's not the outback, but no. how far can I go? How far is this going to let me? Hmm. I didn't know any better. Something's going to come jumping out and go boogie boogie boo at me. Oh, there we go. I hit a wall. End of the road. Okay, then. Back we go. I suppose that's one way to make it seem like you know, the game's really quiet. Okay, let me just change that. Go. Jack it up to that. It might be too loud, but I guess we'll find out, won't we? Well, to be honest, Alan's, like, movement isn't very loud anyway. And so I gotta head to the oil derrick. I gotta find a boombox for said oil derrick. Maybe I gotta find my way up there. Right. So let's try to find my way up to the old derrick and see what there is to see. I got some heavy firepower, so... You know what would really work? Fragmentation rounds. Because they explode. So I just need to check to see if there's a boom box. Right. No boom box here. And so that answers that question. So. Yeah. We need to find a boom box. I highly doubt this car's gonna have it, but hey, it's worth a shot, yeah? Boombox? No. Can I drive it? No. Okay. I mean. Is that car possessed? No, oh, it's got glowy stuff on it. Ooh. So it's like I can drive it. I can't drive it. Damn. Oh, there's something glowing over there. I'll go to that in a second. I just want to see what's here. Ooh, stuff. I like stuff. Oh, I'm full ammo on that one. Huh, full ammo on everything. Well, yeah, I did get that ammo box, didn't I? Hmm. Diesel. I wonder how much per gallon that is. I don't know, but let's just go to this. Yeah, that looks like a caravan or something like that. Oh, it's a TV. It's a TV. Yeah. Let's listen to the TV. Oh, hell. This isn't going to be good. Is this on? How can you tell? I'm sorry, I'm not very good with gadgets. That's more like it. I'll be right with you. I just gotta do this one thing. I like it quiet. I 
bet you're wondering why this is happening. Why am I doing all this? Why am I so hell-bent on ruining your life? <sighs> you're cramping my style. You've got money, fame, everything you could want. But you don't know what to do with it. I do. I'm getting all the things you never had the balls to go for. Having more fun, too. <sighs> <laughs> Do you know the real difference between us? I'm not afraid to be the center of attention. This poor slob's just collateral damage, really. I mean, I made some information out of him earlier. But this part? This is just for kicks. So quiet. He crazy. That's not denying it. He crazy. Yeah, so that's that doesn't help with my little problem here. So I have to find a boom box. The only boom box I know is I mean, she was using a boombox, kind of. She was using the radio. There's a radio here, but that's not a boombox. Oh, I'm an idiot. The diner. The diner has a jukebox, probably. You know, with the whole, like, rustic American look that this has. I'm almost certain that the diner has a jukebox. Still locked. Okay, guess we'll try the back way. There was still that mention about the spiders. Nah, that's a coyote. Or is that a jackal? Nah, I think it's a coyote. Is there anything here? No. Yo! I'll just wait for you to reach. Hey, there's some of that. Well, that's surprisingly effective. Not too sure about the ammo, though. And that burnt through a lot of it, I, I'm gonna guess. Yeah, that's, that was half my ammo. Yeesh. Maybe the, maybe the nail gun was a good choice to get. No, blocked. Right. So this is not the way to go. Uh, there's a shack over there. Oh wait, no, never mind. That's where that car was. So I, I, I guess I gotta keep going this way? Maybe? Question mark? Is that explosive? Apparently not. First fire, this will work perfectly. There we go. Problem solved. Also, let me know if the audio is better now. Now I turned it up a bit. By a lot, actually. Ten whole decibels. So maybe I keep going this way? And the fact that that area is low up there leads me to believe, and especially since they had some, like, trailer show at the beginning. No, okay, that's not it. You can already tell the sandstorm means I'm not meant to go this way yet. So... I 
There's a snazzy looking car. Oh, it's a police car. No wonder. Oh! I, d I do have batteries. I just have to press Q. Pretty cool for a state trooper car. Let's see a place I can get in. But apparently not. No. Oh, is that another manuscript page? Maybe this will give me some help. I know that when I arrive, the clarity of vision I have now may disappear. I've made my plans. I prepared for this. But I know the transition from the dark place will be hard on me. And not just physically. It may affect my mind, my memory. These pages should help me remember and focus. That's worked for me before. Even if that fails, I think I will be able to trust my instincts. I'm navigating my own story. I'm hoping I'll know where to go and what to do, even if the details elude me. That does not help me in any way. Uh, we'll go. Hey, that looks like a manuscript page. And maybe there's a troll under the bridge. No, but there's that. Hey, is this going to say five? Ten for the Magnum. Right. This is more of a collective file than anything right now. Mostly because I don't have a, the foggiest of what to do. Oh, well, the manuscript page. To change reality, you nudge it into the right direction. Your version of it is there, waiting. It wants to come true. All you need to do is help it achieve its potential. The devil is in the details. You change the details of the scene to match those on the page. If you get the details right, if you achieve that critical mass, the shift will come, and the rest of your new reality overrides the existing paradigm. The lie, no matter how outrageous, is now the truth. This doesn't help me much. Go so have a look over here then. I guess we're just gonna be doing a lot of exploring. To figure out what the hell to do. It's fine. This game seems to be totally cool with that. Ah, oh, flare. I'll take these. Okay! These guys don't want me here. Great! I'm gonna just go back and get that nail gun now. Barry. That's one thing down. Course! So I need a battery and a boombox. Battery and a boombox. Got a manuscript page. That makes, it makes sense now. Some of the Taken aren't protected by the darkness like their comrades. Instead, their aversion to light is so extreme that they literally split into two when they encounter strong light. It leaves the two halves weaker. But of course, their strength in numbers. It's a disturbing development. The dark presence I faced two years ago was powerful, but it didn't have much in the way of imagination. Clearly, the same cannot be said of Mr. All right. So, I got the battery. So I need a battery and a boombox. All right, well, maybe, maybe if I put the battery in first. I mean, there's a radio. The radio could technically be a boombox. Yeah, no, 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 hang on a sec. They said, oh, we'll play the new song from your album. Which leads me to believe... Let's get the nail gun. I want to see what this does. Which, okay, so if what I'm thinking is correct... If 
50 nails, jeez. If what I'm thinking is correct, then I need to power the derrick, come back to the motel, go near the radio, and it will play the song, which will cause the satellite to crash into the derrick, I'm going to assume. I still don't even know how the hell it... I mean, I know satellites can survive re-entry, but not intact. Right. Hmm. So I, 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 I do think that I have to be up here to put the battery in. Question is, where do I put the battery at? Here? No, that's just getting me killed. I know this is a thing. Hmm. Maybe I follow this. Back in a minute. The wheel has been jammed. So something involving a okay. So I need another item then. Something involving a wheel. Okay. Ah, oh, something going over there. Guess I'll head towards that then. Head towards the railway station. Maybe the railway will have something I need. See if the door's open. For me to explore in. Nope! So an old Derek there. So let's explore all my options here. Sup! The enemy tears itself in two to avoid the hated light. It becomes weaker, but more numerous. Such is the arithmetic of horror. Dick, 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 dick. Okay. Nice introduction to the new enemy. What's this manuscript page going to tell me? Yeah, that's eight that pages. Just, the reality we take for granted is softer, more adaptable than we think. Under correct conditions, you can reshape it, turn it into almost anything you want. When it happens, almost nobody notices. It's not that we forget, it's that after the change, there's nothing to remember. Only those who have been directly touched by the powers that can shift reality are aware of the changes. Many are driven mad by it. Others can cope. I'm one of those people. And I know how to wield that power to rewrite reality. Messed up. Okay. Well, considering how he burst through the door there, that leads me to believe. Aha! That looks like the cr Oh, wait. No, that is a... That's a... Carbine, jeez. Something tells me I'm really gonna need the extra firepower. See, dig. That's Kay. two. Just one more to go. Okay, yeah. So I need the crank. So where am I gonna find the crank? I would have expected to be here, since you know railway station. Let's head to the. Let's head to these oil derricks. Maybe these require the same kind of crank to move things. Never mind. 